Before you jump into the video, let me quickly tell you about our math video game called Mage Math and all the other cool activities on our website. Mage Math is a full video game that will help your child become more confident in math and have fun at the same time. On the website we have all our math videos, math worksheets, virtual math escape rooms, math mysteries, and more learning activities. You can find the game and all our amazing website content at magemath.com. There will be a link in the description as well. Hi kids! Today we are going to learn about regrouping with subtraction. Let's jump right in and get to learning. We are going to use place value to help us solve these problems today. In this problem, there are 45 students on the school bus. 17 students got off the first bus stop. How many students are left on the bus? To get started on this problem, let's first line the numbers up correctly. If we look at the 4 in the tens place, we need to remember that this represents 40 since it is in the tens place. The same goes for the 1 in 17. This 1 represents 10 and it is helpful to remember this as we are working the problem. Now that we have the numbers lined up correctly, let's represent these numbers using our place value blocks that I have. To get 45 we need 4 tens blocks, 10, 20, 30, 40, and 5 ones blocks, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So here we have our 45 blocks, and we know we need to subtract or take away 17 blocks. So let's start with subtracting the ones. How many ones do we need to subtract? We need to subtract 7, so let's do that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Wait a minute. We can't take away 7 ones because we do not have 7 ones to take away. To solve this problem, we need to regroup. To regroup, we need to trade one of these tens blocks for ten ones. Now we no longer have just five blocks. We have fifteen blocks now. Now we can take away seven. How many ones does that leave? Let's count and see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's put the eight under the ones place. Next we need to count the tens place, but wait, we're supposed to have four tens blocks, but there are only three. Why is that? Oh right, we had to trade a tens block for ten ones. Let's change this four to a three. Now how many do we need to subtract from three? Right, one. Three subtract one is two, so two goes in the tens place. So how many kids do we have left on the bus? 28! Great job! Let's take a look at another problem. In the school lunchroom, there were 65 kids, and 26 kids left to go outside and play. How many students are still in the lunchroom? This is another subtraction problem. Remember, the first thing we need to do is line up the problem so we can see it better. Now that we have them lined up, we are ready to start. Let's bring in the blocks so we can see this visually. We need 65 blocks, which means we need 6 tens and 5 ones. Where do we start? Right, we start with subtracting the ones and take 6 away. If we look at the numbers over here on the right, we see the 5 on top and the 6 on bottom. We need to take away 6, but there are only 5, and we can see that with the ones blocks. We will need to regroup to be able to solve this problem. So just like in the last problem, we need to take one of the tens and trade it for ten ones. We need to make certain to cross out the six and put a five here because we took one of the tens and traded it for ten ones. In the ones column, we no longer have five, so we cross out the five and put fifteen since we now have fifteen ones. We are now ready to subtract. So what is fifteen subtract six? Nine. 15 subtract 6 is 9, so we put the 9 down here under the 1's place, and we now look at the 10's place. We have 5 subtract 2, which gives us 3. We put the 3 down under the 10's place, and the answer is 39. There are 39 students left in the lunchroom. Great job, guys! You are really getting the hang of this. Remember that when we are subtracting, we can make things much easier 
by remembering our place values. Keep practicing this as much as you can and you will be really, really, really good at this. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Thank you for watching the video. To support me in making more videos, please check out my game Mage Math and the other cool content on my website. I know you will love the game and all the other fun activities for your kids. Please share the link below with teachers and friends. Your support helps me make more fun content for kids.